Hello guys and welcome back. This is One Channel and today we're going to learn how to duplicate patterns. We got Stunner in the building, the legendary awesome. producer. And uh, he's going to show you the first method. Alright. Well first I'm going to remove all this. Hmm. Oh no. That's some unnecessary beat space. Highlight. That, that bracket right there, that little bracket is useful. Remember remember that. The little uh yeah. Alright. So the way I usually copy over patterns to make a full song is I always hit the control A, which is select all. Or I highlight with this little select tool. Mm. So like if I just pick this part, I just wanna highlight that. I do a control C, which is copy, control V, paste. Yep. And, oops. Oh, yeah. So I have to use that uh, draw tool again. That draw. So you don't select it again, then I just slide it over. And then try to find this little spacing. But sometimes you gotta zoom in a little bit to get it right. Oh, you got your time thing wrong. I'll just do it by the step, and then try to get it in there, fit it right. Mm. Dude, that step so, thing was useful. I didn't even know about that. Yeah, it's annoying to get these in there. How oh, that makes a lot of sense way? now, because I've had a, I've had that mistake a lot actually. Yeah, that step. Dang man, that's why these videos are so good. We get like multiple, two, multiple opinions and stuff. Yeah. So how do you do it? Oh yeah, you know, uh, I like to do like a little quick thing where I just like. I just highlight, um, say we want to duplicate this whole part, well, let's let's delete this for the sake of that, highlight the patterns you want, control B, like boy, control B, and then bang, Wait, just like that, control C and then control B, right? just, uh, no, you don't have to control C, you just highlight it, what? so, yeah, you just highlight it, control okay. B, and it just duplicates I it. I know it's, it's flames. It it's flames, dude. Uh, do you mind? Do you know how to like um, like duplicate things? Cause I know you like to make a lot of beats like in the uh, channel rack. Do you know how to like duplicate in that? Oh yeah, in the channel rack, it's the same thing. I mean, if you open this up, I do the control A. Oh, now you can do that control B and then add it in the channel rack. So if you notice, FL Studio doesn't try to like reinvent the wheel because that's basically how you copy and paste. Uh, I mean, granted, not control B. Control B, I think, is something exclusive to FL Studio. But control C and control V and highlighting stuff is something that's used in like almost like every program. Yeah, it's a Windows, Windows command. It's well known. Right. All right. Is that it? Yeah, so hit that subscribe button. Alright, y'all. Hit, <laughs> hit the subby and uh, stay tuned for the next one. Peace out.